Hello everybody, Vince Bognot here. Guess what? Some people don't know that I like helping other people. Yes. And it makes me happy when I help other people because some people don't know that you can get a free copy of Windows 7. Mm-hmm. Some people didn't know. Most of you know, but some people don't know. Okay. As usual, there are a few caveats. Number one, if you want a free copy of Windows 7, you must have a home premium computer or home premium Vista software or above. So that's Vista Home Premium, Vista Business, and Vista Ultimate and the other hundred versions that are above home premium. If you have home basic or starter, you can't be eligible. So you should close this video right now. But if you're eligible, here's number two. You must buy a computer or the Windows Vista software, the actual boxed software within June 26, 2009 and January 31, 2010. If you bought a computer or the box software within those dates, June 26, 2009 through January 31st, 2010, you can get a free copy of Windows 7. And here's how it works. If you have Windows Vista Home Premium, you get Windows 7 Home Premium. If you get Win if you have Windows Vista Business, you have Windows 7 Professional. And if you have Windows Vista Ultimate, you have Windows 7 Ultimate. You know, why do they have like 10,000 different versions of Windows? Why can't they just make one version? See, one, one, that's 11, one. It makes more sense. It'll make things simpler. Like, their ads are running your PC simplified. Well, their stupid versions don't make it any simpler to uh, whatever. This is not what this video is about. So anyways, if you have Windows Vista Starter, Windows Vista Basic, you're not eligible. And if you must have the computer that you bought and the box software that you bought between June 26, 2009 through January 31st, 2010. By February 1st, 2010, all computers would have Windows 7 and Windows Vista would be off the shelves totally. So if you recently bought a new computer, just take advantage of this offer. You get a free copy of Windows 7. It's not technically free because of the shipping by some computer manufacturers. Okay, this is what you do if you're eligible. Go to Google and you type in the search terms Windows 7 upgrade option. The first link you should see is from Microsoft and then once you open up that page you could the title says Windows 7 upgrade option. You scroll down and then you select your computer manufacturer. My computer manufacturer is Lenovo. So I click on Lenovo and you fill out the form. Basically you just type in your name, your last name, your address, your zip code, your serial number, um, when you bought the computer, where did you buy the computer, and where did, and sorry, where did you buy the computer, and you just type in all that basic information until it takes you to a page where you enter in your credit card information. Yes, there's a caveat to everything. You must enter your credit card information for the shipping charge. Yes, they're going to charge you for shipping. Lenovo charges $17.03 for shipping, but some computer manufacturers charge zero dollars so if your computer manufacturer charges zero dollars then you're lucky but if they charge a certain price then you're not and you have to put in your credit card information for the shipping charge okay um if you bought a box copy of windows vista microsoft has their own site to upgrade once you go to that windows 7 upgrade option uh, page on microsoft you scroll down all the way to the bottom and it says if you bought a box copy of windows vista click here and then you just click there and then you can go through the process with Microsoft to get your own box copy of Windows 7. Sound easy, huh? So remember these search terms, google.com, and click and type in Windows 7 upgrade option. It should be the first link you see. And you should be able to get your free copy of Windows 7. Yee! I'm so happy I helped you out. Did you know that? Tell me in the comment what you think of this upgrade option. Bye-bye! Here's a free preview of Pimp My PC. Well, actually, Pimp My PC is free, but whatever. Here's the preview. Bye-bye! Yee! Yo, what's happening everybody? I'm Lucas and welcome back to Pimp My PC. Now this is a show where we're going to try to teach you how to customize, personalize, trick out that PC, but above all, make it cool. Now love it or hate it, XP is going to be around for a few years more. And what we've done is put a series together we like to call the XP IMP series. Uh, it's a little more clever than it sounds, so Maddie, why don't you flash that up for me?
All right, so what we're going to try to do with this series is give XP that new car smell without shelling out that new car dough. Actual software, Windows Vista, came in the actual CD that Vista was... Ah. So anyways, what you do if you bought a new computer on June 26, 2009 or later, and if you bought Vista, the actual software... On, let me redo this, dude. Do you want a free copy of Windows 7? Well, not for me, but if you're from, 